in Minnesota too. Senate debates right around the corner, and that includes for one of the most watched races in the entire country, and it's right here in North Carolina. Washington correspondent Kelly Meyer hears from the candidates on the issues and what they believe is the biggest issue for voters this November. This North Carolina Senate race is becoming one of the most watched Senate races in the country, and time is running out for the candidates to let voters know who they are. With just two months from Election Day, North Carolina's Senate candidates are working to make sure voters know what they stand for. My priority is going to be to continue to do what I did when I was Speaker of the House and what I've done as a U.S. Senator. Incumbent Republican Senator Tom Tillis says he's fighting for the economy and against tax hikes. And I think Cal Cunningham has already said he'll raise taxes. He supports the Green New Deal. Those are questions that the North Carolina voter needs to see the answers to. But his competitor, former North Carolina State Senator Cal Cunningham, says he wants to cut taxes for the working class. Would put money in the hands of, of working people and parents as they raise children. And Cunningham says after five years in Washington, Tillis has forgotten what North Carolina voters really want. A senator who's going to fight corruption, uh, work to expand health care, invest in education, build a stronger economy. Their differences will be on display when Tillis and Cunningham have their first debate later this month. Tillis is already calling for more. Trained attorney and he's unwilling to debate us. Tillis is calling for a nationally televised debate while Cunningham wants the focus on North Carolina voters. It's one of a number of ways that the voters here are going to size up our candidacies and how we would serve in the United States Senate. The outcome of this race will help determine which party ends up with control of the U.S. Senate during the next Congress. The Senate is currently in Republican control, but Democrats are eyeing this seat to flip North Carolina and the Senate blue. Reporting in Washington, I'm Kelly Meyer, CBS 17 News. Yeah, thank you, Kelly. And the debate she's talking about there, it's going to be one right here on CBS 17. It's happening in less than three weeks, and we need your help. We need your questions. You can record yourself asking a question, then send it to us on CBS17.com. We will then show those questions to the two candidates and see how they answer your question. The debate, again, coming up Tuesday.